Um, it was my dream car, the, the M4, when I was a kid. I always wanted one, so now that I have one, I'm, I'm the happiest kid on earth. Big kid, but happiest. <laughs> I'm on my way to, to Remus today, it's a big day, I'm getting a brand new exhaust on my car so I can't wait, I'm really excited to see the result and, uh, and meet the guys. So we just arrived at the workshop with my uh, brand new BMW M4 competition. So before that I had an M2 which was equipped with a Remus exhaust and today is the day where we put the Remus exhaust on my M4 so I can't wait. So we race all made where the magic happens. Obviously everything starts from this, that's the main part, the tube, which will get bent and obviously bigger and smaller parts. And as you can see there's many machines, go step by step. And in the end it's like racing, it's, it needs to be efficient. Every person has its own, own job and the uh, objective is to lose as less time as possible. So it's a big organization and it's impressive to see from inside. It's funny how you can walk through the factory and see the exhaust coming together. And the more you walk this direction, the more you see shapes that uh, you will see on your car. So, uh, Painting chain here, so first they clean the parts there, then they obviously there is the rack, the parts travel. You can see here, those are ready to get painted, and there's a waterfall behind. And the waterfall is basically catching the extra paint, the pollution of the paint is touched, and there's no marks, it's just perfect result in the end. So it's very technical, and I would never have believed this if I didn't see it. So, my baby is for the day, uh, we're gonna get them installed. I can't wait to unbox them and uh, show you what's in there. It, uh, Probably amazing. So we have uh, tailpipes, delete tubes, silencers, and the uh, connection tube with the uh, valves. So we're getting to business now. Nice. The silencer, all stainless steel, even a nice pair of gloves to get equipped before uh, taking it out and installing. Coil looks amazing. Very cool part. The tailpipe, so this is the white chrome. Again, some more gloves. Packaging is really all in one. Wow. Look at this. Next one. Ooh, I like that. Carbon, really racy. Finition is super nice. I'm getting excited here. And the last one, some instructions again. You can scan the QR code. Nice protections. Black chrome. It would be a hard choice, so I'm interested to see what you think. So we have a very hard choice in our hands right now. Carbon, chrome, black chrome. So what to put? That's the question. My two favorites, definitely carbon and chrome, so I think the best way is to check it out. Definitely a bit bigger than the original, so that's positive. And I really like the carbon because with the carbon diffuser and the, the carbon parts on the car, I think the carbon will, will match Remus logo. Big uh, upgrade on, uh, on the car. A few more boxes to, to open. Again, everything is nice and protected so you can make sure it gets shipped and doesn't get damaged. Those are the, the link pipes. Again, all um, stainless steel with gloves, all the material to fix them. You don't need to order anything extra. You get it home, you fix it. So I think that's really positive and uh, I've been in the trouble where you get parts home and you're missing half of them. I think that's definitely not gonna happen. So really cool. Here. That's the delete pipes. 
very nice part. Simple, goes to the point, and I'm sure it sounds very good. Let's get to work now. Oh, wrong way. Ooh, it's more complicated than I thought. We need to do this again. First time I see my car like this. <laughs> so we are replacing this part with the silencer. Then the link pipes here, we found this too well. Um, we leave the OPS filters in and get the DD pipes around here. But I'm gonna be honest, I'm not a professional, so I could be wrong on that. Don't catch me on it. I let the remus expert uh, doing it and showing me. looking a bit uh, a bit empty here but <laughs> what we put in will be better what do you think happens if we run like this do you think we have an issue so when I was younger I had a very small quad I removed the exhaust so similar to this there was nothing just uh, exiting the engine and it uh, started making bubbles kind of the uh, same sound as if you make bubbles in a bath which was uh, interesting but not the ideal outcome hopefully we do better than that it's super nice, just 10 minutes in and they're already uh, putting back on the, the new exhaust behind me. It's very impressive how, how good and how quick and easy it is to do, so uh, I'm really looking forward to, to that. I love cars, I'm, I'm passionate about cars to be honest, so ro racing car is one thing, but on, on the road I like nice cars, also you know, need to think if I want to go skiing, what can I use, uh, I need to, 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 to drive myself through Europe too, so I always dream of an M4, for sure I also like supercars, but you cannot use them every day, so for me this is the ultimate uh, daily, because okay, it's very sporty, and you still have a big trunk and space, and now it will be loud, so. I think it's not only about loud cars, it's about uh, life in cars and you know I was, as I said, I think the M4 for me was, was a dream and then I got it and I have to say with all the new Euro European regulation it was very quiet compared to, to what I expected and uh, that's what Remus does well, is giving life back. So I, I really hope and I'm pretty sure looking at it right now it, it will make that engine sound good and, and you just have this feeling which is very stupid but uh, it makes me smile. I go on power and I smile, and then I know that's a good car. So correctly, the, the OPF filter is, there's a sensor that um, if you take it out, for sure the car will get louder, but it, it will not work after. Up 4,000 RPM, I think it, it dies, because it, the car understands that something is wrong, which obviously will keep the OPF. So it will run and it will still be fine, and with no issues, no need of remapping ECU, and that's what I want, I want it simple. I don't want to have to spend uh, 20 days in the garage trying to make the car work. Job done for me. Job is done. Really cool, really nice. I mean, the, the pipes are much bigger, so all stainless steel. Uh, really beautiful quality. The tape apps in carbon, I'm Super happy, uh, it matches the car perfectly, so I think I did the, the right choice here. And uh, again, the important part for me are the valves sorry, here. Because, uh, you know, I, I like loud cars, but I also like my uh, calm city driving with, with no noise, so I'm happy to see them here and still uh, happily staying. And now I think it's time to let's go and test it out. So it's time to see how it sounds. I can't wait to press that uh, button here and then hear that. So this is the, the test track. I just hear it how it started. It's, it's amazing. So now at least I can properly try it. It sounds a lot more rough. 
parking. much louder, so much more rough the sound. <laughs> oh my god, this is making me purely happy. I'm a big kid. Thank you Remus for making my car alive again. I feel like the happiest guy on earth. Honestly, this car is back alive. It couldn't be more than expected. Really, it's really amazing. What I'm really happy about is that um, now I have the valve closed. I have the, let's say, the quiet mode, which I want to use for the city to be able to not uh, bother my neighbors or stuff like this. And you can hear that when I'm driving, it's uh, really totally acceptable, no vibrations, nothing. And then I just have to press one button and it gets alive. And I can go back obviously anytime I want to the quiet mode. And again, you can hear directly that it's a big difference and it doesn't bother anyone. And it still sounds good, still sounds better than original but very acceptable and you will not bother anyone in the moments you need to. So this is the first step before the sound chamber which is just behind this wall. They are attaching some uh, ropes to the car to make sure it doesn't go crazy in there. You see we'll be pulling on a, on a bench and um, just to make sure the car stays stable and doesn't go right or left or anywhere we, we don't want to but you will see it's a very cool room. very oppressing it's so quiet you even you don't even hear your echo it's very strange feeling Awesome day today at Remus. We fitted the new exhaust. I will take the, the road back home now and I uh, hope to see you soon. Hope you enjoy the video. Bye.